Let's start boom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was cr I'm going in this way. <laughs> the other guys would turn around and go, what, what the fuck? <laughs> Another good thing you could do is put like a friggin mine there. I'm going to do that as well. I'm going to put a mine there the next time. It's hilarious. Right, here we go. Right, I'm not going to use a grenade naturally. Here we go. I'm just gonna do that for a sec. Got a guy coming in between those vehicles there, I think. What's wrong? We got this guy here. See, it's all fine. They'll wake up before long. Come on, get moving. Actually, I want to get over there something under there. Huh? I hear something. I don't. Go check it out. You might be surprised by what you find. Ta-da! Nothing! <laughs> I guess it doesn't matter, really. Got some bullets. I really should change my camouflage. Uh, face... Woodland. Uh, sorry, I've got gas. I'm just finding it hard to talk right now. Doki. Is there something in there? Yep, there is. Huh? <laughs> Sorry about that. Okie dokie, alright. More TNT. The machine gun thing we got before, the XM16 E1 thing. I think that was what it was called. Right. That's everyone out cold. Now we can go in through the front door. There's nothing wrong with that. We can go in there. Or we can go in through the side entrance right here. It's uh, right here. There, you see? Actually, I'm just going to check and see. Yep, stuff here. Claymore and smoke grenades. We don't need any of that. Now, I think we can descri describe. I think this is the place where we're able to disguise ourselves as a scientist. I don't want to do that, though. I actually just want to get in there, run around, and be a derp. So, yay. Look forward to me fucking this up as usual. Come on, Lord, please. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to hear that either, dude. Huh? Hmm, footsteps. Huh? Footsteps. Do 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 do. Huh? Nobody here. Huh? I have 
footsteps. Oh, there's a pretty lady on that lady on that thing there. Nobody here. Wow, that's actually going rather well. Okie dokie. Yeah, hard to believe that there'd be a box in a building. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. <laughs> Nobody heard anything. I just wanted to go in there and look at that, because I'm a derp. I'm a, I'm a complete perv, is what I am. I think we have to go down into the basement. Maybe not. Maybe we have to go up. I'll go up first, I suppose. Okay, that guy. Ooh, frick. That would have been bad if I decided to rush out there. <laughs> Nothing happened at all. Let's see. People are opening doors downstairs, everything's fine. Freeze. I'm just whistling, don't look that way. No, wait! Anything? Nope. Anything? Nope. Anything? What the fuck? <laughs> Fly uniform. Oh. oh, wait, 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 wait. Poisonous spider. People at home, don't be afraid. The spider can't hurt you. Don't know why you'd be afraid of spiders anyway. Got an extra silencer. Some undead woman up there. Okay. This is a nice way out of the building as well, actually. It's not the way I'm going to be using, but... Look at that, some weird anime thingy that's too low res to tell what it is. Nothing there. Stuff. Okay, right. Well, we're getting things done anyway. These guys will wake up very soon. We don't have time for faffing about. Oh, 
There we go. We stand out like a sore thumb. Right, so now we're in the, the basement. This is where spiders bite you everywhere. So be very careful when you go down here. I'm speaking for people that actually want to play this game after seeing me fuck it up. I know that's none of you. Just stop here for a sec. See? He's gonna make his way back in there. At least I think so, yep. Freeze! Uh. Who's that? I told you about that spider. Serum. Oh, this is bad. Bring it! Both of your legs are hurt, dude. You know what? Oh fuck, I screwed that up. I decided to do a reload of like, because I thought I save stated to when I loaded in. Oh, that was stupid. Oh, I'm just gonna go get the fly thing and the silencer. Who's that? Or I'll just be a friggin' idiot. I am so terrible at this. This is what happens when you play like an emulator because you have a keyboard and not just a gamepad. So you screw shit up like this. It happens. It happens pretty much all the time. It's really annoying, but this time I'm going to be much faster. Who's that? I hate myself. I really do. I was doing so good and then I just... Effed it all up and uh, I would cut this shit out, but uh, I can't pretend to make myself look good at this game. Uh, pretend to make myself look good, yeah, it makes sense. Dude, come on. This is one of those games where you, if you fuck it up, you feel like an idiot. Because you can't fuck this game up. If you're good at games, that is. Then again, it's like this is one of those games where it's like every time you screw something up, it's easy to. It's like. I don't know, it's something that you normally would find really easy, but in this case, you just fucked it up. <laughs> right, here we go. Open this door. Get in here. Pick up the silencer. Right. Get in here. Go here. Oh, almost. I tried to get out of the way, but I accidentally did a combo. Fuck it, never mind. Spider. Want it. It's funny how punching them kills them, but... I don't get it. It's like, that shouldn't kill. I'm gonna go this way this time. Just out of curiosity. Another calorie mate and some noodles. Alright, I'm gonna try the noodles. 
I don't want to eat that. Well, I'll have, I'll have a nom of this. I'm gonna puke. We'll try something nice then. That's damn good. You're right. I love me some instant noodles. Let's get another calorie mate going. Can I like dive over there? Nope. Can't get over that either. Fuck it, never mind. Right, now. Ah, making some progress. And I just realized that that was a reference from another game that I like. I'm just gonna stay and stave. Save it there because I'm a dumb shit. Someone else is gonna come along now. Come on. The guy that saw me the last time, basically. What's wrong? Nothing's wrong, my friend. Everything's just fine. It was a normal day, and then his life turned around. Dude, get down. <gasps> the freeze. <clears throat> that is not what I meant to do. Oh my god, no. What? <clears throat> Nothing. He's fine. Ignore it. SVD and M37 rounds, I don't need either, apparently. God, it's like when my inventory gets this full, I start thinking I'm like playing World of Warcraft. Let's have a look. What's this? Mode. I don't know what that is. Metal Gear Solid 3 on Play 2 magazine. Wasn't there, didn't there like used to be a magazine called Play? Pretty sure there used to be. I used to get magazines. Be careful. Don't keep running into things. What's this? More life medicine. See, I, 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 I don't mind going into these places to like find stuff. I'm actually, I'm actually quite enjoying doing that kind of thing. It just reminds me of playing the first Metal Gear Solid. Wherein you would always go into, into vents like this to do stuff. So there's nothing there, it's just a toilet with flies around it. You know, if this game were more funny, you could dip your head in it and that would just be hilarious because pff, why not? People like doing shit like that in video games. In real life, nobody would ever think of doing that. Well, then again, maybe they would if they would bet like a million bucks. Hey, you, I bet you wouldn't dip your head in a toilet for a million dollars. You bet I would. Then people just look at that person and say, Dude, no. Either that or girl. No, it's a girl. I don't see a girl doing that though. Mouse trap. Wait, I can just. I don't need a mouse trap. Unless because I want to annoy some guy when he's taking a leak. Like it would jump out of the toilet at him and it'd snap onto the end of his dick. But the, the force to which those things snap. Ooh, it would hurt. Huh, there's nothing there. So most of this is a dead end and pointless. Better go quickly. If I had some porn mags, I'd put them down on the ground. Not because I want to fap or anything, but because the guys would stop and have a look. Like, just take this for example. Stare. Stare. Wait, yeah, I should stop that. Well, I'm a guy. Chill. Right. Now, as far as I'm aware, I'm pretty sure we weren't supposed to come here necessarily. Is it? There's like another place to come, but I can't remember where it was. It's like that way or something. I don't know. I'm confused. There's another. There's more stairs downwards. Let's figure this out. Let's figure this out together, guys. 
We can do it! I'm just gonna wait, see what happens. Huh? A box. <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> right, that was me trying to grab the guy. I'm not kidding, that was me trying to grab him and take him down. I'm just gonna try this out very quickly. I'm just curious about something. What's that sound? Nothing actually worked that actually worked I why didn't I think of that oh, well, that looks stupid right here we go this is where we're supposed to be <coughs> sorry dude but yeah that guy heard me coming up from behind sounds wrong I know more stuff for me. A cigar gas spray. Now, if you're actually wearing your disguise, which you should be, if you're actually wearing your disguise, you can just walk right up to people and cigar spray them in the face with it. With that cigar, basically. And guys like, what the fuck? There was a box there? It's just staring like a friggin' loon. Dude, don't do that. You look creepy. Stop it. Uh-oh. Whoopsie daisy. Uh-oh. I have no choice. Blah. Try again. Maybe I should just change it. I don't want to change into this guy, though. I just want to... <sighs> Never mind. You know, actually, I'm not going to change into this guy. I am just going to be a douchebag. Watch. I'm going to go here, and I'm going to go into backpack, and I'm going to go into weapons, and I'm going to go... Let's see. Um, Claymore. Oh, not just Claymore. I'm also going to go TNT. Oh, do, 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 do. Sorry, I'm in considerable pain right now. Ouch. You don't need to know what's in pain, but... My guess is you wouldn't want to know what's in pain. Come on this way. Look over here. Look over there. Footsteps. Huh? Footsteps. Huh? Footsteps. Like that. Right. No then. I'll want to put... Why can't I just... What the fuck? What's stopping me from putting it down? Alright, there's something... Alright, why can't I put this down? Alright, what the frick? There's something seriously wrong with this. I shall be able to put this down wherever the hell I damn well please. Six break. God fucking open. I hate that.
Uh, I don't like how that door just opened. Can't find me. Let me drink in peace, what the fuck? <laughs> <It's> quiet. <laughs> wrong. What's wrong? Huh? <laughs> Damn it. I like how like the most support shows up and <laughs> all these guys are just lying here. <laughs> and the guy's like, I'm a dragon beast, what the fuck? Watch your door and shut off, god damn it. What's wrong? I didn't even mean to do that. Metal Gear Solid theme playing in the background. Breaking the fourth wall again, are we? There's even, a, looking for soccer, love. there's even a Metal Gear Rex and a Metal Gear Ray in here as well. Behind him is Ray, and on the desk is on the desk is Rex. Away, you'll spoil my drink. So, you're the intruder everyone's talking about. Typical capitalist dog. No manners. Yeah, damn capitalism and it's allowing people to have money. And who are you? You mean you've never heard of me, and you call yourself an agent? Very well, then. I am Alexander Leonovich Granin. Good. A man of some importance, if I do say so myself. Bit arrogant. Okay. I am the foremost weapon scientist in the Soviet Union, and the head of the glorious Granin Design Bureau. This is the Order of Lenin. It is an honor of the greatest magnitude, given along with the title of Hero of Socialism to only the finest workers. It was awarded to me in recognition of my brilliant contributions to society. Uh huh. Since the Great Patriotic War, I have created countless weapons in the service of our great communist society. It was thanks to me that we were able to stamp out the Nazi scum. It was I who created the basic design for the mobile ballistic missile system you know and fear as SS-1C. I don't understand it. I don't know what it is. Sorry. But I know that you're drunk. Ah. <sighs> you're crocked, aren't you? I'm merely drowning my sorrow. Because of him, I've got nothing to do but sit here and drink this crap. Him? Sokolov. It's him you're looking for, isn't it? Nah. Because of him, I have been stripped of my authority. My research has come to nothing. Look! It is a revolutionary mobile nuclear missile system. A 
bipedal tank. Metal Gear X. Awesome. A bipedal tank? Just having a look around? Yes. A walking tank. A robot. A robot? Are you familiar with the theory of the missing link between apes and humans? Whatever that means. Well, this Ray. technology will be the missing link between infantry and artillery. And Rex was next to it. Of metal gear, if you will. And this magnificent metal gear will mark a revolutionary step forward in weapons development. Metal gear. <laughs> but I won't be used so easily. No. No crying myself to sleep. For you see, I'm going to send these documents to my friend in the United States. What? It's very interesting. These bastards will live to regret this. And when they themselves become the targets of my creation, they will know my true greatness. Yes. Sokolov's pathetic shagohard pales in comparison to my work. That's true. What are you going to do with a rocket engine on a tank? About Sokolov. A tank does not need a rocket. It needs something else. Look at these. Shoes. Nice shoes. No. Legs. Legs that allow it to go anywhere. Just there. as when humans learn to Rex. walk upright. That is the real revolution in weaponry. Don't you agree? Maybe. But the fool's in charge. Joe Sokolov. Those Maybe idiots. Sokolov. My project has been terminated. The philosopher's legacy has been handed over to him. What the hell are you talking about? The philosopher's legacy. Not the stone, then. Haven't you heard of the philosophers? Yeah, they made stones. The colonel has inherited their immense legacy. So he's immortal. Wolgin's father was in charge of the philosopher's money laundering activities. In the confusion of the war, he somehow ended up with their treasure. And Volgin inherited that treasure illegally. Okay. We never need to worry about the military budget. The development costs at our facility are all paid out of the Colonel's deep pockets. The weapons born here will be the genes for creating an entirely new form of warfare. The funding for my research came out of that legacy. Came out of it. Now. My money, my men, all have been diverted to the Shagohad project. Tomorrow they will be conducting the final test, while Sokolov is making the final preparations in the weapons factory at Volgin's main base, the great fortress of Grozny Grad. Here I am, playing host to an enemy spy and drinking myself into a stupor. Sounds like a fun That's existence, doing, Sokolov. Yes. And the Shagohad is there too. Of course. Hey, you're not thinking of going to Grozny Grad. Yeah. Are you mad? It's an impenetrable fortress. I'm sure it is. You'll be killed. I'll take my chances. Wait. What? Listen to me, you fool. I want to help you. Help me? To thank you for your compliment. What compliment? Shoes. My shoes. Tatiana gave them to me. I wanted to thank you for complimenting me on them. What's with the lag? <laughs> I'll tell you how to get into the fortress. In return, I ask only that you get that idiot out of there and destroy the Shagohad. There is an underground tunnel that runs around the perimeter of the fortress. You should be able to use it to sneak into the base. Head for the mountains. The entrance to the tunnel is located there. Take this. You passed through a warehouse on your way here, didn't you? Yep. Yeah. There should have been a locked door inside of it. 
Do you remember it? No. Uh. This key will open that door. Beyond that door lies the vast jungle. You can climb up into the mountains from the far end of the jungle. Go back to the warehouse. Use the key to open the locked door and head for the mountains. Got it? Fair enough. Why are you helping me? <laughs> Unlike Sokolov, the thought of defecting has never once crossed my mind. You just helped the enemy is all. I love my country. I don't understand why. I love this land. I cannot even imagine living anywhere else. I wish to remain a hero of the great motherland. I cannot bear the thought of being hounded into a corner and left to waste away. It is already dawn. We must hurry. I will remain here and nurse my troubles for a little longer. Okie dokie. To capitalism! To being able to have money to get food! To not being in a country where you have to go to Siberia! For not being shot for leaving the country! See? Now, I could get out by using my, uh, insane disguise. What, are you seriously giving me away? Uh! <laughs> oh, you fuckers. What the fuck? You know what? Fuck this shit. Why do I keep looking up?